lot of work to do out there this morning, guys, but hopefully this weather will allow people to get out and do just that. I mean, that's exactly right. Thankfully, we do have a very calm pattern in place over the next few days, and not mm -hmm. only is it calm, but cool. Uh, yeah, so a nice feel to the air for us today and through the upcoming weekend. So lots going on, and that is such good and bright news for sure. Yeah, so right now in Nashville looks good, and speaking of bright, you can help us spread sunshine every day with our Good Morning Sunshine videos. Tell us who you are. Weekend, uh, if you've uh, got a little time, to, uh, tell us who you are, tell us where you live, uh, gather friends and family, 10 or so seconds of video, <laughs> send that on in to my 5 at newschannel5.com. This is a very popular segment, so videos submitted today, probably I think airing the second week of June. i show you what is up right now. Some folks, uh, after all the rain, that grass is mile high, so you get the opportunity to do that. Slight shower chance in uh, eastern areas today, tomorrow. Rain chances pick back up as we go into next week where it looks like there may be a more of an unsettled weather pattern. Ton of stuff this weekend. Steeplechase tomorrow. It's May, so our friends at the Tennessee Wren Fest continue their activities during the weekend. The Strawberry Festival, it's Strawberry time in Tennessee. That's up in Portland tomorrow. Actually, the parade tomorrow, but they've got activities going on uh, today as well. And the Strawberry Jubilee over at the Nashville's Farmer's Market. Nice temperatures for you both weekend days. Also, this weekend, Nashville Shores opening for weekends before they go to their daily schedule Memorial Day weekend. Here's a look at what's happening for you now. Uh, we're good. And then later today, upper 60s, lower 70s out there. Some students who get cool easily may want a sweater, a light jacket this morning. Temperatures around the 70 degree mark later. That's below the norm. Meanwhile, for tonight, upper 40s, low 50s. So it will be a crisp feel to that air tomorrow morning. Here's the morning weather map. There's the front and all the activity that is now down to the south. Still some clouds out there. So on the back side of this, there may be a mix of sun and clouds over the Mid-South Forest for today. But all in all, it's good. Right now, Nashville 64, Bowling Green's 59, 64 back over near the Memphis area. Temperatures running just a little bit below where we were at this time yesterday morning, Nikki D. And, you know, it's all about that feel. And as you pointed out, if you do get cold easily, believe it or not, this would be a day that you might want that light jacket because of the crisp air in place. Temperatures, as Leland just pointed out, not a huge difference from just 24 hours ago, but it feels like there is. And you're really going to notice the feel as well as the number difference as we make our way throughout the afternoon. So those thin clouds Leela just showed you, they're going to continue to work their way out. We'll see a mixture of sun and cloud cover as we do go throughout the day with very nice, bright conditions. Now, as far as a tiny sprinkle or two, we cannot rule that out. Areas across the plateau, this would truly be the exception rather than the rule. And you can tell by this model run, it wouldn't add up to too much. Just a quick blimp on the radar and then making its way out. Now, overnight tonight, clear skies, winds are going to be light, and temperatures get chilly. We'll be waking up tomorrow in the upper 40s as well as those low 50s. Wind-wise, we'll have a little bit of movement, but overall, very nice and calm conditions will be with us in the days to follow. As far as rain chances, though, those are going to start to move in as we head into our work week next week. This is a very broad brush perspective as far as things are concerned and our severe threat continues to be on the low end. Highs today, upper 60s, low 70s, that 10% truly one or two tiny little showers across the plateau. Tomorrow and Sunday mornings, we will be in upper 40s, low 50s, afternoon highs 76, making it a great day maybe for a picnic for mom Sunday after church. Yeah, and then going into next week, temperatures upper 70s to mid 70s, a bit more of an unsettled weather pattern next week, so some rain and thunder Storm chances in for each day, Monday through Thursday. Not looking at a washout at this current time, but of course, that is so far out. Mm -hmm. A lot of details will be made as we go throughout the next few days.